Hi guys, I'm Jojo from Your Love. So, you had a good Halloween. It was more quiet than normal, right? But it was fun. The sun this week is in the sign of Scorpio. Happy birthday to you. We love you, Scorpios. The moon will visit in the signs of Taurus, Gemini, Cancer, and Leo. Well, this Saturday is a very big day. We have a full moon, beautiful full moon in Taurus, bringing breakthroughs and luck to all of us. A good time to really wind down projects, get rid of old bad habits, and complete assignments. And also, we have a one-time Venus Uranus opposition that can bring a little bit of sort of a, a need to make over or adjust certain things in some relationship. It sort of brings a deep, deep adjustment in a way that it's erratic a little bit, a turning around of situation in finances and political affairs and in relationship. So it's sort of like in one way, very lucky, very optimistic, but another way, an opportunity to really make some kind of U-turn in our lives, okay? In business and also in love. This Saturday night, it's very important to turn your clock backward before making dodo and enjoy an extra hour of sleep on Sunday. And this Sunday, Mercury, planet of communication and passionate Scorpio enters idealistic Sagittarius, making our thinking process definitely more fluffy. A little bit all over the place. It's not easy to focus, in other words. With a tendency also to forget about details, and we shouldn't, but we may have a, a tendency to be more like bigger picture. And to say things we don't want to really say, so we need to think before we talk, and also make mistakes in business. We have to be double, double cautious and double, double wise and don't take any chances and money, investment and all that stuff. And also be extremely kind and patient and generous until the end of the year. On Monday, the moon in Gemini will make a beautiful sweet sextile to Uranus that brings a feeling of rebirth, of hope and to do, to do the right thing for ourselves and other people. On Tuesday, Venus Planet of Love in Peaceful Libra will enter intense and emotional Scorpio. Matters of the heart will be taken to a very high point of life and death. It's extreme, it's passionate, and we have to make decisions. But one way or the other, the universe will let us, let us know what to do. It's important also that day to dig deep in the relationship sector of our lives and make the right choices and let go which doesn't work for us anymore. On Wednesday, the moon in Cancer making a very nice trine to the sun and Neptune, but opposing Pluto, well, it's a day to dream very big, but to be grounded, okay, especially with money matters, not to take any chances. And on Thursday, the moon in Leo will trine Mercury square Uranus. Sun sextile Pluto also making us more sensitive than normal, but extremely creative. So all artists and creators, innovators will do extremely well. And they're gonna just do something out of the box. Wow. And if you're in the contest, if you're an artist, you could win. On Friday, the moon will square the sun sextile Mars, bring high energy and also a feeling of hope and the ability also to be more aware of who we are and what we want to accomplish. So let's listen to the synchronicities of that day. The universe is talking to us, okay? So let me start with you, with Scorpio. Happy birthday to you. We love you, Scorpios, because you are the sex symbols of the zodiac and you're also psychic. The full moon in your relationship sector and Mercury entering your financial house brings high, high intelligence and luck. Hope for your future. A good time to make serious decisions in your relationships dieting, exercising, losing weight, get back in shape, all good. Travel, romance, games of chance, also favored. So do play lottery on the weekend. Look your best, the world is watching. Your magical color fuchsia, lucky numbers, four and 22. Sagittarius, this is a super week. The full moon in your work sector and Mercury entering your sign brings you popularity, confidence, freedom of action, and also prestige. Good time to really take control of your life in love and career. You've been working on this for the last few months, well now do it. Let go of the past and what doesn't work for you 100%, okay? Be brave. 
Take risk, experiment, and also dream, dream spectacular. You could also be offered a lucrative new contract or a new job or some increase or promotion or something like that in career. And if you're single in love, you should go out because you could also meet somebody special. On the weekend, tenderness awaits. Are you ready? Yes, you are. Cancer Leo also are our lights. Your magical color orange, lucky numbers 523. Capricorn, the full moon in your romantic sector and Mercury entering your spiritual house. You feel more deep and also sensitive for the needs of other people. The emphasis is really helping, advising, and making people happy, and making a difference in your community and also in the world. There's a humanitarian that is very strong this week. In career, new opportunities to knock maybe some people out of their socks and to convince them for a project is definitely in the air. So just be daring and push for it, and you'll say, you'll get a yes, a green light. On the weekend, Definitely also love rocks you gently. Ta-da! Enjoy your magical color silver lucky numbers 6 and 33. Aquarius, the full moon in your home sector and Mercury entering your social house brings good news in your domestic and family life. It's a very good time to investigate and look for the truth. In career, new doors open up for you, so be daring and take a chance. The focus is on good humor, confidence, popularity, and a sense of adventure on the weekend. Get ready for smiles and also affection. And surrender a little bit. Express your emotions. Your magical color yellow, lucky numbers 7 and 34. Pisces, Pisces, the full moon in your communication sector and Mercury. Planet of communication entering your career house makes you psychic, confident, and super, super, super creative. Brainstorming with friends could really provide great ideas to make some progress in a very special project and also in your relationships. It's important in love to take the lead and make a fresh start. On the weekend, friends and family are definitely supportive. You feel really supported all week. A Taurus, a Cancer really makes a difference and they believe in you. So say thank you and trust what they say. Your magical color pink lucky numbers 8 and 44. Aries, Aries, the full moon in your financial sector and Mercury entering your comic house brings self-confidence and luck and love. Venus in your financial sector invites you to take charge, lead, and also delegate. Family is very generous, ask and you shall receive. Some people may see you as a role model. On the weekend, freedom and joie de vivre is in the air and it feels great. Your magical color yellow, lucky numbers 6 and 24. Taurus, Taurus, the full moon in your sign and Mercury entering your shared resources house, bring a new beginning and hope more peace. Mercury in your relationship house also brings more stability and peace in your love life. A good time also to settle some legal matters and taking care of your budget and to maybe, maybe ask for a loan or get a promotion. You also may benefit from other people's money or receive new exciting ideas from an ally. Listen, decide later though. Wait for next week. Forgive also the past and dream, dream, big dreams on the weekend. Your magical color green, lucky numbers 7 and 16. Gemini, this is a lucky week. Yes, my little twins, you are feeling good with yourself. The full moon in your spiritual sector and Mercury, your ruler, entering your relationship house, gives you stamina, assertiveness, confidence. It's time to take a risk in career and try your luck in the new ways. You should also play lottery because money comes your way these days. A good time to imprint your own style and be the best you could be. Right here, right now. Don't be shy. Shine. On the weekend, you dance with life and you love every minute of you. It's like you're celebrating you. Your magical color orange, lucky numbers 8 and 17. Cancer, the full moon, your ruler in your social sector, and Mercury entering your workhouse brings prestige, optimism, and health and awareness of who you are. In love and friendships, wow, what a difference a week makes. Expect to reconnect with someone very dear to your heart and to be spoiled. In career, the energy is back in the flow. You sort of know where you're going and things are starting to open up for you. Get ready to receive many, many invitations socially. And this could be a wedding, a party. I know you're just like, you're going to be invited. Go, go to all the parties, go to all the whatever. On the weekend, chill, relax, and also enjoy life to the fullest. Meditation, yoga, dancing, singing, all suit your soul. Your magical color, pink lucky numbers, 9 and 36. Leo, the full moon in your career sector, and Mercury entering your romantic house brings breakthroughs 
positive changes in your personal life. Everything is becoming a bit more stable. Always make sure to wish well the people that you left behind if you had a divorce or a separation because everything you, you think and everything you say is about you. And somehow you could live something that has to do with uh, legal matters about a separation or an adjustment or a divorce or some arrangements about some legal matters in dealing with relationships and unions and making a deal. And it's all going to work out good. In love, married, it's like a fresh start awaits. And if you're single, you could meet somebody amazing. And flirting could really turn into something really serious. So if when you go out, whoa, things are happening. A good time also to affirm yourself, fight for what is right for you, and listen to wise advice from a Capricorn or a Taurus or a Cancer. On the weekend, it's bubbly happy. Your magical color gold, lucky numbers 1 and 46. Virgo, Virgo, stars smile at you. The full moon in your comic sector and Mercury entering your house of home brings confidence, peace of mind, beauty, and the ability to connect well with the people you love. Get ready to be free from the past, to start fresh. Put on a beautiful smile on your face because everything is possible for you now. In career especially, you have more confidence than ever and you could accomplish anything. Just go for it. On the weekend, strong feelings of freedom and a new beginning awaits. Aquarius, Cancers and Taurus play an important role and if you're single, definitely go out because you will meet somebody really nice. Your magical color blue, like in numbers 2 and 11. Libra, the full moon in your shared resources sector and Venus, your ruler, entering your financial house and Mercury entering your communication house, that's a lot of stuff, bring sex appeal, romance and good fortune and business and money and investment. Wow, what a happy, lucky week. Communications are favored, you know how to communicate with other people, catch up with paperwork, make your phone calls, promote yourself write the emails, text whoever that is important that you want to reach out because you'll get some positive outcomes. New hobbies can be therapeutic. A luxury item also that you wanted to buy is not available. Please go for it. You deserve it. On the weekend, time to spoil yourself and the people you love. Your magical color, lilac, lucky numbers, 11 and 21. And now here's your wizard affirmation of this very nice week. It's sort of a mid-election day on Tuesday, and all changes start with us, as citizens, as individuals, okay? One person at a time, so more than ever, it's imperative to get involved in anything to do with voting or something you believe in, and the right person, the right politician that you believe in, because every vote is the, what makes the change in the world. It all starts with us, okay? And remember, governments and politicians work for us not the other way around okay so do your duty and you will make a difference love you guys be good see you next week bye